The 2017 Seoul Motor Show opened at Kintex in Goyang, Gyeonggi-do Province on Friday. Vehicles equipped with the latest technology were put on display, while eco-friendly cars take the spotlight more than ever. This hydrogen car that Hyundai Motor Company will release next year can travel 580 kilometers on a roughly three-minute charge. Heated competition between South Korean and Japanese car makers in the area of hydrogen cars, which do not emit any pollutants, are evident. In the show, Lexus unveiled its hydrogen sedan and Honda its SUV, which has already gone into production. In the show, which is the 11th of its kind to be held this year, a total of 50 types of cars, or 20 percent of total car models displayed, are eco-friendly vehicles, revealing the future of the auto market where the era of the internal combustion engine is coming to an end. Plug-in hybrid electric vehicles, which can be both electrically charged and fueled by gas, are being applied in sports cars given their high fuel efficiency and driving performance. This car can make its way out of the narrow exhibition hall on its own, with the driver doing nothing, while South Korean IT firm Naver showcased a self-driving car produced by remodeling an existing vehicle. This year's show, however, saw a drop in the number of participating companies and new cars. The only new model revealed for the first time ever in the world in the show was a large-size SUV, which Sangyong Motor Company released for the first time in 16 years since unveiling the Rexton. 자동차 기술만이 아니고 우리가 자랑하는 무선 통신 기술, 전자 기술이 융합되는 그런 모터쇼로. It seems that the Seoul Motor Show could strengthen its uniqueness if it draws active participation of South Korean IT firms, which boast the world's top technologies.